Hello everyone, this is the demonstration phase of the example code called arm gripper using the function, the regular function. So in this program, is we want to do is use the mini arm as an adaptive gripper by adjusting joint offsets. Uh, previously joint offset, remember we use it between minus 255 and 255, but this time uh, we do the same, but it presents on the present loading on those servo. So I created two uh, motion lists of patient. We say one open arm. These are the position uh, of, uh, of interest to it. Three, four, five, six, like in here. So this is the open arm motion page. The closing arm pull page is, you can see in this picture. So if you concentrate on, for example, at the actuator number three only, open mean it's set at position minus 73.24 degree close mean it minus 90 degree okay so put in the function in relation to the server number three here so minus 73.3 is about here minus 90 is here so to close the arm you have to move the actuator number three clockwise therefore to open the arm you need to move it counterclockwise right so counterclockwise in the position of the joint offset meaning is the joint offset value had to be positive so to open servo number three we need to increase its joint offset so that's the key analysis and key point I want to show so in the code itself there's a main endless loop again okay so if the user set up the commands and group places to go three it will invoke close arm, okay? So we'll close it arm all the way to a very small position. But the key here is how can we set it up so it will have different object or different sizes. This close arm position is still working for us, okay? So the close arm, remember, so the basically it's a fixed uh, motion page, but we can adjust the joint offset so it can squeeze away just enough on a different size object so that's a call a just join offset function is to do and that function there actually analyze four servo servo three servo four servo five and servo six and i'm just showing the one for servo three here just to show you the principle so when it's processing servo number three it read the present load, save and current load three. If that current load is less than 128, no adjustment need to be made. That means it's still moving in the air. It haven't closed up on the object yet. Else, if that current load is bigger than 750, and then it need to add one to each each time. So you can see that this algorithm here, this adjustment three is cumulative. Basically integrating on it adding one unit of joint offset every time. However, as you know, adjustment on your joint offset can only be more than 255. So if it's get to that point, it's 255. And then it's set whatever that adjustment three is to the joint offset. So you can see that same trick again. If you play a motion and you just, just joint offset, in a way you can get motion out of stillness again. But this time it's based on the load on the specific servo okay so let's see how it works let's see i got the serve bot is already working there let me stop let me start again and see okay it's running push one set position Up, ah, it's ready to receive the code. The uh, the uh, the object. Hang on. So if I push down, yep, that's my fault. Okay. So you can see adjusting for a big size object now. Okay. Actually, I can bring it in so you can see all the running. Okay. So I open it up. 
And then it's this side now. So you can see it adjusting even at the same uh, close arm, it will adjust for different sizes. Okay, let's open it again. And let's put the big one back in again just for one more show. There we go.